Were you happy to leave the show? I mean, I, I was. I, for me personally, I was so at that that point. I was just so deep and dark that yeah, uh, that was not a, even in the the thing on my my radar. It was more let's go party and let's go live this other life. Um, you know, so I mean, I wasn't really upset. I don't even know that I really knew what was going on. <laughs> to be totally honest. How do you feel that your relationship with Lauren Conrad kind of played on television like that? I mean, was that a serious relationship for you? Yeah, no, we were we were very very close, and I mean, it it uh, it was hard too because not really. I mean, going through my own struggles and not knowing what I know today about addiction and just the the, the disease model of it, and just the you know, it's a brain disease and it's, it's a mental disorder, um, and just having all that stuff tied into it, it was hard to. Obviously, having any relationship portrayed on TV is hard, but also when you're sick and you're not knowing what's, what's, you know, what's really going on, right. uh, made it even that much harder. Was she understanding and supportive of you as, you know, not just as like reality cast whole aside, but just as your girlfriend? Did she understand? Do you feel like most people that age understand addiction and how to support somebody through that? No, not at, not at all. I mean, you know, she was very supportive. Don't get me wrong. That's to answer the first question. But the reality of what it is, I mean, like I said, you know, growing up, we never had the education or the knowledge that we do today about addiction uh, and, and the the detriments it causes in your life and you know for for all i guess it got to a point where she couldn't take it anymore and i couldn't even take it anymore on my end you know what i mean and just Mm -hmm. had to cause that separation and that wedge um but she was very supportive through everything but we didn't know we didn't know what to do at that point has lauren reached out to you at all since you've come out with your addiction and and sought treatment and are now in recovery We've been in touch. We've we've touched space a few times, and it's just more. I mean, I actually reached out to her to to make amends for everything that you know that I had done, and take ownership and yeah. accountability for everything that had happened. And you know, we we were able to to reconnect, and and everything's good. But I think it was I reached out to her initially, you know, just for <laughs> all the damage that I had caused. <laughs> um, and you know, she was very appreciative and, and understanding of it. And um, you know, but that's that's a part of the process. It's part of the recovery part.